logs taken. In. Excess panels on the inside of the tailgate, and I'm trying to see if I can look in. See the mechanism that keeps the gate from opening. take the whole panel off and attempt to then I can see everything no weird bright red spiders in here that is can get this mechanism loose Thank you. 
obviously not how that's designed to be used, I think. You can take the back glass clips off. Sharp fall in my face. Most is what I have to normally do. one of those uh, machines at the gym for leg exercise.
didn't break the latches. A lot of times I have to kick the gate open and bust these pop metal latches. We probably still use those. Kind of curious if there was anything in this trunk. say I need to smile more but not really something to smile about when you have to break your way through a tailgate so now I want to see what's inside this trunk besides dead rats and I don't know what not much one of the missing pieces of trim some new belts and a mouse nest and a Sears Allstate spare tire with a tube. And if there's anything hidden underneath inside rat poop. Nope. But the trunk floor is there which is all that matters. Some big rat turds in there. Yeah. Had to bit get open anyway. And this piece can go. Been saving this for a rainy day. I'm thinking the tailgate was locked. There's a little cam in there that keeps it from catching. I might have to drill out the lock to get this to work. But I can take this apart. This is four bolts.
gas tank might be okay. Take the regulator out and give me access to the back of the window crank. Hopefully, that'll allow me to make it to where I can use it. There's that. that right there is what turns and rotates allowing the window to go up and down. I'll see about taking the crank out. that off. I guess is somebody locked this back in the day and lost the keys. So I'm gonna take it apart here. Take off this metal clip. So that's what the lock looks like for the tailgate window crank and it fits in there but to get it out use a pick do that little access after you take off the block you got to take the pick and push this brass piece in which is what locks it in place you can see the little square cut out so I put a pick in there push it in it just pops right out and to put a new one in you just stick it in there and push it in it snaps in there's a little groove that that brass lock fits into oh, what the January 31st 1964 I guess that was replaced at some point oh, I wonder if this whole tailgate was replaced because the back of the car was painted I would guess. This piece has that locking cam. 
So without the key, that stays open, which turns this. When you put the key in, you lock it, that goes in, so it just spins around. So anyways, so now when I turn the crank, you can see it turns the splined end. Now I'll try this again.
fine tuning skills. Thank you. 